Why am I surprised? I don't exactly have a plan B. There may be a way. Pathfinder, apologies. There was an urgent message for you. They said your sister is awake. What? Go. We'll talk later. In the tech lab. Sarah. <laughs> Little brother. Bring it here. Man, it's good to finally see you. It's good to see anything. I was starting to think I'd never wake up. Well, I sure missed having you around. We've hit a few rough patches along the way. I'm sorry I wasn't there when Dad died. There's nothing anyone could have done. I wasn't even sure I should tell you. I'm glad he did. Gave me time to let it sink in. I'll miss him. But I also know he'd be the first to say, get over it, and get on with it already. Oh, there's been plenty of that. So I hear, Mr. Pathfinder. Not by choice. Uh-huh. Then I guess I'll overlook your little embellishment. You told me we found home. I... Yeah, yeah. I know you meant well. But no more lies, okay? I'm a big girl. I can handle it. From the sounds of it, you're going to need all the help you can get. Careful. No way are you fit for duty, miss. That stubborn skull of yours needs a chance to heal. Says who? The Pathfinder. That's who. Time to rest up. That's an order, Specialist Rider. <sighs> yes, sir. Pathfinder, sir. <sighs> oh, who are we kidding? <laughs> I saw you eat your own boogers when you were six. If you two want to catch up some more, that's fine, but no getting out of bed. <laughs> 